Yeah, Jackie, uh, we've had crews here all day inside the courtroom, and it wasn't until just after 6.30 that this jury came into the courtroom and told the judge that they have found Robert E. Crispin Jr. guilty on several counts, but guilty of first and second degree murder, as well as robbery, as well as theft, uh, and some other charges as well. But of course, most notably on those murder charges in connection with the death or killing, I should say, of Tammy Long back in July here in Armstrong County. Now, we talked to the jury foreman who uh, stepped outside the courtroom, and, and you don't always get this sort of interview, but he spoke out and sort of told what was going through the jury's mind and said that it was just difficult to listen to some of this testimony during this trial of the strangulation of Tammy Long, of her being hit over the head with this toilet seat. Uh, we also talked to the defense attorney, though, for Mr. Chrisman, who said that he was surprised the jury uh, came back with a verdict so quickly tonight uh, and that, of course, you know, he thinks that it's the wrong verdict in this case. Now, Miss Long's boyfriend, uh, who was home with her that morning and then had left shortly before uh, Mr. Chrisman was at the house, uh, he, he spoke to me very briefly as he was leaving the courthouse today and sarcastically said, happy birthday, Robbie Chrisman, and then said Tammy's birthday would be coming up this weekend and then he said happy birthday happy birthday Robbie and then I asked him I said are you happy with this verdict and he said yep very much so uh, a lot of emotion here both families crying in the courtroom after this verdict and then hugging uh, on the side of Tammy Long's family out here on the streets so we'll have a lot more details on this though coming up at 11 o'clock for now reporting live in Armstrong County Bo Berman Pittsburgh's Action News 4.